Sunday. This is our house, and we live here, and we put on shows here. Here it is. <laughs> Sunday for me is just like a comfortable, like, I don't know, it's an art gallery, but I, I hate that word, like, I don't like the word gallery even. So I feel like this is so much more, it's like a, a workspace, I guess. It's, yeah. it's like our home, yeah. and <laughs> we get to host all kinds of people here in our home. We make art and collaborate. <laughs> Sunday Store is part of the gallery. I started finding a lot of work on Instagram of artists and just asking them if they wanted to put some things in here. So I curated this like little, it's kind of like a show with people's work that I liked. A lot of people putting themselves out there and showing work, um, but maybe not in like a physical space, just like on the internet. And I kind of wanted to bring that into a physical space for Sunday. There's so many people that want to be involved in cool stuff and like think that what we're doing is really cool, so that's really cool. The <laughs> show that we had was called Hot in Here and Audie curated it and it was 47 artists and it was huge and really fun. It was all girls and uh, it was really hot in here. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that I wanted to have like a group show because we haven't had in a while, but I wanted to have more meaning than just being like a group show. And all of these artists that I had been finding on Instagram were like coincidentally girls. Um, and, but then it became kind of like a theme like, oh, like there's so many amazing women artists that I know. There was like 500 people here yeah, there over was, the course of the night. Yeah, it was like every, like I just ripped my pants off in the show and it was so hot. But, I think that all art should be able, if it's successful, it should be able to be like understood by anyone that walks in here. Like people should feel something emotional from it and it should like do something. I think it's also really important for people to like embrace their femininity and like I feel like a lot of people like in order to be more powerful like as a woman will try to be like more boyish or something or be more like a man or something but I feel like it's really important to just like be a woman and like act how you Whatever that means to you. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I mean, it could be being a bo boyish or whatever, but I feel like a lot of times girls like feel like, I don't know, like less or something if they're like acting like a woman. <laughs> I think that like girls and everyone like should be able to do whatever the fuck they want. Like, and then just have it be that. Like, it sucks that people will label it as like, you know, girly or even like fem or like whatever. Like, even if that's what we are, like, there should be... You should be able to be like lots of ways. Yeah. Not just girly or frivolous or masculine or whatever. It's good for girls and women to have like strong connections with each other. Yeah. I think like a lot of women spend a lot of time trying to tear other women down and totally. like not support each other. And like also for art, like my art, I feel like a woman can understand my art in a way that a man never could, mm -hmm. because it's a, a lot of my art is about being a woman and like my own personal experience. And I feel like a lot of the work in here is like super feminine, but really powerful. Like it's not like frivolous at all. Like, I don't know, it really speaks to me. 